Today we are in lesson 47. What are the shoes of the gospel of peace? So you probably have more than one pair of shoes, right? I don't have very many, but I know I'm not going to wear flip-flops in the wintertime, right? When it's cold and, you know, if we get uh, really cold like it did this last winter. Um, and I'm not going to wear boots in the summertime, right? There's just certain kinds of footwear that you would wear depending on the situation. So we're reading today from Isaiah 26, 3 and 4. Lord, you will give perfect peace to those who commit themselves to be faithful to you. That's because they trust in you. Trust in the Lord forever. The Lord himself is the rock. The Lord will keep us safe forever. So just like you would wear, like say for instance, if you were a firefighter, right? You're going to wear uh, boots that are made with rubber, something that's not going to burn easily. And God is reminding us as we're speaking about the, the um, armor of God that we're to put on the shoes of the gospel of peace. So as we go throughout our days and we're um, desiring to share God's word with others, we need to be wearing peace, right? We need to be carrying that along with us. Peace is just a calmness, a quietness, a lack of worrying about things. And it says here that the Lord will give perfect peace, not just peace, but perfect peace to those who commit themselves to be faithful to him. That's because they trust in him. So if we're trusting in God, if we are committing ourselves to him faithfully, he's going to give us that kind of peace that we need to then be able to go out and share the gospel with others. Isn't that a special blessing? I know I need that in my life, that sometimes I let the things of the world kind of get me... Um, worried and, and frustrated and not sure what direction to take, but God gives us those shoes of the gospel of peace to be able to um, face our days peacefully. Lord, we thank you for giving us peace, peace when um, life can be full of turmoil. Would you help us all today to walk in those shoes of the gospel of peace, we pray in Jesus' name. See you guys tomorrow.